Hello everybody, welcome to the Sound Test Room. Today we are taking a look at Beat Former by Accusonis, which is an AUV3 um, sculpting uh, effect for drums. You can use it on anything else. I'm going to show you it used on the synth as well. And I'm going to show you it used in a couple of other apps. I'm going to do something in Stage Light so you can hear it in that. And then we'll probably do something in AUM so you can hear it in that. So you're getting an idea how it works. What's remarkable about this is Beat Format. Accusonis, it, this is free at the moment. It's completely free. Now, I have no idea if they intend to keep it free forever or just as an introduction. Hey, it's free. Check it out, you know. Accusonis make very, very, very professional professional software for the uh for, for you know for win for, for, for mac and windows uh, a while ago they they contacted me ages ago and asked me to review some of their stuff and i reviewed beatformer and also their noise reduction software which is just incredible just one knob control bang no noise that they put that on it it's incredible but what how they've done it for free if you want to go and buy beatformer which is basically the same thing it'll cost you 99 dollars on you, you know your, your computer so the fact that it's free is just remarkable the thing's incredible um so i i'm i guess i'll use this in pretty much everything from now on because it's just so blinking good right okay so i'm going to show you how it works it's kind of like a transient thing as well it's a tra transient shaper i guess you could there's the closest way to describe it but it does a lot of other stuff as well but it's very simple this is the only screen so here it is on the there's no effect applied here this is just nothing so i'm going to put it onto the drums i'll take it off let's solo the drums and hear that again let's hear that again So we'll have a mess around with the sounds. Now, you see this? This where it says boom. Okay, you can see at the moment it says boom C2. You can tune your boom. Yes, yes. Let's just set this at just uh, the D1. Now listen to the boom. This is adding so much control over that kick. But listen to this, right? Say you've got a particular track and it, it's important that the kick and the, any booming it's making is in tune. So let's go right up to, say, A, A sharp. Hear that? Put some headphones on. So next one along we have punch. And you can left and right or mid and side. We can squash it proper. Still have the boom in there though. So this is just playing along with the default. Now, I for some reason, I can't work out how to save a patch, but you know, you get a few to start with. You can add some top end there. So let's switch it on for the synth.
Rivera G. Brilliant. Brilliant. Completely brilliant. Now, okay, so let's have a listen to it in stage light. So I've already set it up in stage light with uh, just a, if we have a look here, just this drum pattern here, which is doing, the, I'm not sure if the effect is on it, probably is. So let's start that off there like that. this seriously for free Okay, so let's go and have a listen to it inside. Let's just quickly set something up in AUM. Of course, because it's AUV3, it works and everything. So let's see what we've got. I'm going to try it with Rock Drummer. Uh, into audio. Let's try it with the Rock Drum Machine. We can find it down in hall. There it is. Okay, so the thing with this. Uh, okay, let's start it off. That's quite an open kit, yeah? A lot of room noise. Now, the the good thing about we can use this, let's put this in first. Um, it's the first one up. With with Beatformer, is, it's great for getting rid of that. If you've got a drum kit or a loop or something that's been recorded in a lively environment and, and you love it, you know, you love it, but you think, God, I wish I didn't have all that extra ambience maybe we could put even some more let's take that out let's put some more ambience on this kit so let's go to our effects here let's reverb okay so there's quite a lot of a lot of ambience and reverb and room sounds going on in there and reflections and stuff that you may have on a loop that you just don't want. Or you may want to shape the sound from that particular effect. So let's just go back and have a listen to what we can do. So let's start our drums off. And let's start with the default patch here. Add something more control over the kick. Well, let's try and get rid of all that ambience now by pulling the squash back. Now listen to how powerful that kick sounds now as well. Even further. We're losing some top end, so... We can make it sound extreme. Uh, 
and without. Fantastic, eh? I mean, to, to, to be honest with you, in in, in my opinion, I, it's free anyway. But in my opinion, this is just essential. What? How? How? How many times would this not come in useful? You know what I mean for anything. It also has the ability to. Uh, I like I said, I did a demo for the actual uh, desktop version ages ago. So if you search the sound test room, Akisonis Beat Former, you, you'll find it. But uh, how would this not? It's what if you've got drums in a mix, right? And you want to pull those drums forward without doing loads and loads of extra EQing or stuff, stuff like that. Uh, if you put Beatformer on there, you you'll you'll be amazed at how I mean, get it? It's free anyway. You know what I mean? Just I, I think it's I think it's epic. I think it's a great job. And like I said, you do get a few. I haven't worked out how to save your own settings, but it's so easy to manipulate. Start with something like um, like intensify or something, and then you can start to shape as you wish. It's very quick. to get what you want. I mean, that kick drum's really... Awesome. There you go. Beat format, Aki Sonus. AUV3, 100% free. Now, I honestly don't know if it's free forever or it's free for a bit. I don't know. Not a clue. <clears throat> anyway, thank you for watching. I'll put a link in for Beat, uh, for Beat Former. So I can go and grab it quick. And uh, thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Consider becoming a patron for as little as a dollar a month. I can't survive without the community, guys, seriously. And uh, yes, yes, I will see you guys later. Ta-ra.